Hey fellas, it's Dragon Critic. Now, you know, sometimes you know I can get pretty annoyed over a great studio making something bad when they can ha when they have the time to do something very great. Well, today in school, this thing really annoyed me. We got back from our school tour from the play burn. Guys, it was pretty bad if you want me to be honest. The other school tour we went Clara Lara was absolutely fantastic. But however, this is the thing that really annoys me. We came back from the school tour, we were going to be watching the Lego Batman movie. The the Lego movie spin-off, because like, they're doing, they're, because I know for a fact that they're doing lots of spin-offs for the Lego movie. Ah, love Coke. I love it so much. Love it. Anyway. You know, like I was, like the Lego Movie team are doing Lego Movie spin-offs, like they did for Batman and the Ninjago movie coming out in October. However, this thing really annoys me. The Lego Batman movie wouldn't work. So, will I tell you what we had to watch? We had to suffer. We had to watch the Boss Baby. And the thing that really annoyed me that the little kids were enjoying it. I was suffering through it. All I was was saying to myself, Give me how to train your dragon 3. Give me how to train your dragon 3. Give me how to train your dragon 3. <laughs> and, and I said, Dude, let's go kick that baby's ass. And then my friend goes, No, we can't. This is way better than those movies. And this, and this little kid goes up saying, Oh, this is better than Kung Fu Panda and how to train your dragon. That really annoyed me. It just really annoyed me. Also, like, the thing is, Boss Baby ain't mature. If you can enjoy it, that's good. Good for you. You have good power. You have good strength to watch it. I can't stand it, because it was horrible. But, Kung Fu Panda and How to Train Your Dragon are mature. They've got mature, dark films. Let's look at, um, The Messages. Kung Fu Panda 2 talks about genocide. Yeah, you don't get that in kids' films, do you? You don't get that in Boss Baby, do you? No, you don't. How to Train Your Dragon 2, Death, Family, Kung Fu Panda 3, they talked about, um, Li Shan's wife's death for a scene, and family and all that, and in the movie, I'm not gonna say, I'm not gonna spoil it, but there's a scene where Poe actually risks his life for his own race, that's dark stuff, now, with this film, Boss Baby, it's absolutely horrible, I was just sighing, I was just suffering on how bad it was. Then the SNA goes, uh, "What do you do? You not like it? Said, What's wrong? With it? What's all wrong?" And I go, I "Don't like Boss Baby. I hate it." Then she goes, "The other kids are enjoying it." Then teacher goes, "If you hate it, Lee, I mean, sorry, my bad, <laughs> my bad. If you hate it, then go back to your own classroom." Then I just looked away, and I didn't even roll my eyes. And the teacher accuses me for just rolling my eyes, and then. You could either sit here or watch it. So I had to sit there because I didn't want to do work. No, because I'm exhausted from work. And pretty much, I don't get how people can enjoy it. That's the thing, like, how? Explain. Reason. Reason. Now, we were actually going to watch Team Warriors versus Team Zombies, which, by the way, will be uploaded to my main channel on Friday, June 30th. And the premiere for that one, for number three, will be out on Friday and will be uploaded to my third channel on June 30th and the third film will be uploaded to this channel on July 7th. Sound good? I think that sounds absolutely perfect. And pretty much, here's the thing, like, I don't get that. It's like as if this is, like, what? Do we have to watch animation all the time? Come on! Let's watch something else! Some different genre! Spider-Man! Come on! But, this is just stupid, which really annoys me. Now, Kung Fu Panda 3, I would say this, almost as dark as number 2, and How to Train Your Dragon 2. Almost as dark as those. But it's not as dark, because they need a lot more dark tone to it, and there needs to be more of a tone to it. There needed to be more dark. The third film did need to be darker, but I'm fine with the tone they used, and still love the movie, and I will make a video of what I want to do with it. But, that just annoys me. When people are, you see these kids nowadays, and they're like, oh, that looks great, the mature one looks bad. 
and my friend Devin, um, yeah, my friend Devin, he, he was saying to this girl in his classroom, said, I loved Zootopia very much because of its great message and being mature. Yeah, Zootopia was mature. Then the girl goes, no, as in, like, correcting as if she, he was wrong. He, and she said she loved trolls and thought that was mature. <laughs> Mate, trolls wasn't mature. It just isn't. It's not, it's just a kid's film, and Trolls sucked. And she thought How to Train Your Dragon 2 was boring. Well, guess what? How to Train Your Dragon 2 is way better than Trolls every single way. But it just annoys me to see that animation is being not mature, and they need to. And pretty much, humor is, is bad as well. Now, you see the false babies butt farting. Now, I know many of you are going to say, Oh yeah, but you laugh at the minions when they show their butts. But they do it in an out way, an out humour way. Boss baby does it in a kiddish way. I'd understand if the little kids would like it. For young teens, I just don't understand. Minions do it perfectly. They do it adultish. This film just doesn't. Anyways, guys, that's my rant, and I'll see you guys next time. Well, not my rant, but it is kind of a... Rant, but anyways, guys, see you next time. Skadoosh.